hello guys I'm back with another video this is the cinema build just been updated and um, I'm gonna try to keep this video short so I'm gonna jump right into it here we have our search metallic movies TV shows trailers real the bread 4k movies kids channels your music your add-ons your weather settings and we're back to search all right now let's go into search. Here you could search for a movie title or a TV show title. Let's go to TV show title. And I've been watching this show um, recently. So I'm going to just put that in there. Alright, I'm going to just pick any season. I'm going to pick season 3. Um, Angels and Monsters. And here's your list of add-ons you could choose to play the TV show from. I usually use StreamHub. If that don't work, I use one of the other ones. And as you can see, I do have my real the Brit account in here to um, show you guys that you get better streams with it. All right. So that's how the search work. You can search for movies or TV shows. In the sub menu, by pressing down, you have movie genres. And you also have um, TV, TV show genres. Alright, next we have our metallic. This takes you to the metallic add-on. Where you can navigate to your movies, your TV shows. Alright, let's go into movies. I'm going to go to popular and you can add movies to your library from here. I'm going to add um, the Hitman Bodyguard and I'm going to scan item to the library. So you have to hit your context button and you'll see this list and scan item to library. All right, you could also do the same thing with your TV shows. I'm going to go to popular. And I'm going to add and I'm going to just add Twin Peaks. I'm going to scan item to library. Alright, as you can see, it's added. Let me back out of here. And in the sub menu, you have your movies and your TV shows library. Let's go into movies. This is the movie I just added. I'm going to go into it and here's your list of add-ons you could play the movie from and here's your TV shows library and this is the TV show I just added and you could also choose from which add-on you want to play the TV show from all right here we have our movies pressing up you have your widget 
And um, let's just go into the first one. As you see, I was playing it. I'm gonna just start it from the beginning. And it's um, one click. So it's, it's, you don't have to pick a, um, a link to play the movie from. All right, this is the new um, Pirates of the Caribbean movie. As you can see, it's clear, it's in 1080. Let's choose another one. Let's try Snatched. All right. Let's fast forward it a little bit. All right. Clicking on Movies itself. Takes you to the Elysium add-on. Let's go into popular. And um, let's choose the layover. And do know I do have my Real The Brit account on here. Because um, as lately these add-ons are not giving me good links. So you could benefit a lot from the Real The Brit. Um, if you have an account, you could benefit. And, you know, the benefits it gives you, you have more options and more links to choose from. And do know if you're using the Elysium add-on, you would have to go to that add-on, hit your context button, and then go to settings, and then um, enable the Real the Brit um, function in there. All right, let me just stop it right there. As you can see, I get 1080p links and a lot of 720p links. All right, let me back up out of there. In the submenu, you have Covenant, People Watching. Let's go into People Watching. Alright, so you have some movies in here. It's a 2017 movies. Here you have um Cirrus Movies, Film Cube. Let's go into Film Cube. I'm going to go to all movies. And um Let's choose a movie. Let's choose. As you can see, I've been playing some just to test them out. All right, let's go to Scream 2. All right. So you have a ton of movies here. You have 49 movies here. Here you have Flexanity, Stream Hub, Supremacy, Box Set Kings, Poseidon, Bennu, Movie Dude, Real Movies, Wolfpack, and DeLorean. Alright, here we have our TV show section. Pressing up, you have your TV show widget. And this is popular TV shows. Clicking on TV show itself. It takes you to the Elysium um, TV show section. In the submenu, you have Stream Hub, Supremacy, Flexanity, Poseidon, Bennu, DeLorean, and Wolfpack. Right next, we have our trailers. Pressing up, you have your widget, your trailers. Let's um, go into this one. I'm going to choose a link. Let me skip it. Alright, as you see it plays. Clicking on trailers itself. You just back up one time. Here you have your options. You have latest on movie trailers. Most watched, top 10. This is all by initials. Opening this week and coming soon. Here you have your Real the Brit section. 
pressing up you have this widget and you have some options here and keep note you're gonna have to have a real debrid account to play any one of these if you don't have one it's not gonna play so let's try the first one 4k movies all right give it a second to load up All right, so you have, as you see on the top, you have 157 4K movies. Let's play one of them. And you're going to have to have a good internet connection. I played this one already. Let me test, a, I'll test another one. I've already played it. As you can see, it's in great quality. It says NA because it doesn't pick up the um, 4K thing, but it's playing in 4K. Let's go for another one. The Ridiculous 6. Alright, like I said, you're going to have to have a strong internet connection, but you see it plays and is in 4K. Alright, so that was the 4K movies. We're going to go to 4K TV shows. Alright, let's go to the first one. And here you have your um, season and your episode. I'm going to skip ahead. Alright, so this is growing as it goes. And here you have your kids' movies. Alright, um, let's go for cars, tunes. In great quality, it's 1080. Let's go for another one, Despicable, Despicable Me 2. I said my connection is not that great, but um, they work. Let's go for another one. Finding Dory. Alright, it's so also in 1080p. Alright, so you have a ton of movies in here. That's in 1080. Even some older ones. As you can see, it's 2007. Let me give this one a go. Alright. Let's back up out of there. And you have top movies. You have movies 2017, movies 2016, 15, and you also have um sports. Let's go into the sports. Go to latest everything. All right, just give it a moment for it to come up. All 
All right, so here you have, you know, newest links. As you can see, this was added on the 7th. This one's added on the 5th. All right, so if you missed a, a, sport, a sporting event, you'll have it here. You have to fight right here. Floyd Mayweather versus um, Conor McGregor. All right, so you have... If you're into wrestling, you have it in here. All right, let's just click on this one. And you click on the link. Now it's getting a link view and pops up. Skip ahead. All right, so we have that. Let's back up out of there. And here you have your James Bond movies. See, let's go into superheroes. And you have your Marvels or your DC. Let's go into Marvel. As I stated before, you're going to have to have a real the Brit account. It doesn't cost much. It's a couple of bucks. I have it for um, six months. All right, let's go to Hulk. As you see, it's 1080. All right, we're clicking on Real the Brit itself. It takes you to the Supremacy add-on, and you also need the real, you know, use the Real the Brit account for this also. All right, pressing down, you have your sub menu. You have Blu-ray movies. And you also need a real the Brit account for this. Let's um pick one. Let's just pick Bad Boys 2. And this is from the Pyramid add-on. Alright. All right, so you have another huge list here. It's 159 in this list. All right, next we have our 4K section. Clicking on 4K. And you have some 4K movies. Some of them you need a real the Brit account. Some of them you don't. Let's try one without a real the Brit. So I'm gonna do the Fury 4K movie. All right. Let's get up out of there. It says SD, but it's not an SD. It's in 4K. I said some of them is in um you needed the Brit account, but some most of them in here you don't. Alright, in the sub menu you have Supremacy, Real Movies, and Maverick 4K. Alright, here you have your kids section. Alright, yeah, you have a list here where you could go into and play you know some cartoons for the kids. You have kids movies, real movies, um, kids, and kids corner. Let's go into real movies, kids. As you can see, I was playing some already just to test them out. They play pretty good. I'm going to just go into this one. It's a sing. As you can see, it's in 1080. I'm going to give it another one, Kung Fu Panda 
All right. Let's back up out of there. But um, oh, let me go back real quick. In the debris section, you also have the kids. I'm not sure. Let me show you the kids real quick. You have better quality um, movies for the kids in um in this section. All right, you have better quality movies for the kids. As you can see, they all in 1080. All right, I'm gonna play Tangled. All right, it's also in 1080. So you have better quality. As I said, use a real, you know, get a real debris account. All right, let's move it along. Here we have channels. We'll go into channels. And you have a list here, it's 193 channels. All right, as you see, I tried these already and they work, even though it says zero minutes. Let's um, try Cartoon Network. All right, now do note when exiting it out of it, ex when you exit out of it, it takes a couple of seconds for uh, it to go back to the whole menu screen. All right, you have Comedy Central UK, Comedy Central USA, Discovery Channel. You have Disney Jun um, Disney Junior, Disney XD. You have Food Network. You have the FX Channel. Hallmark HBO, HBO Comedy, HBO East, HBO Family. Let's go to HBO Comedy. All right. And these channels are always up and running. And um, a lot of people ask me for the repo for this add-on. There is none. There is no repo for this add-on. Um, let's keep going down. You have TV One. Nick Jr., Nickelodeon. You also have some Showtime on here. Here we have some Showtime. Two, Showtime. Let's go to Showtime West. All right, give it a couple of seconds to come back out. I right, have some Sky movies in here. It work really, really well. Stars, Sci-Fi Channel, TBS, The CW. All right, and you also have your sports channels here. So you have 88 sports channels here. All right, in the sub menu you have streams TV, you have TV. Let's go to HGTV. All right, you have stream one and stream two. This is taking it from the sports devil. All right, you give it a moment for it to load up. She says in 1080. All right, so you have some channels here. I've added these channels to the super favorites folder so if you want to take it out you could take it out if you want to 
I was just hunting down for some channels that work on Sports Devil, so I decided to add it in the Super Favorites folder. All right, here you have USA Streams. All right, so you have 145 channels here. Some of them work, some of them don't work. All right, you have Fido TV, you have Goodfellas. Let's go into Goodfellas. Let's go to sports channels. And um, let's go into live events. Live sports, you need the Stream Hub add on. All right. Now it says, please do not remove this app from your iPhone and all devices. This app is not available on the App Store due to premium channels. Once you remove this app, you will never get it again. Okay. As you see, I tried some links. Some is in HD, some is in SD. So I suggest if you find a sports channel that's working for you, you... um. I'm going to just try anyone. You just add it to your favorites. Alright, so you have 260 channels here. The ones I've tried work. I haven't tried. Let me try one of these. Sky Sports 4. Right, as you can see they work I tried the BT um, BT sports 2 I've tried let's try Sony ESPN you give it a couple of seconds for it to catch on here we go let's back up out of there You have your Fox Sports. You have your BN Sports. You have your Baseball. Two hundred and sixty. Um, let's try anyone. It's Fox Sports three. You have NBA Golf. You have the NFL Network. As you can see, I tried it and it's in HD. You have NBA. All right, let's just back up out of there. And you have all uh, Made in Canada, Supremacy, of course, TV One, Stream Hub, News 12, and Project Cypher. All right, here we have our music. Clicking on music takes you to the Django add-on. I'm going to browse music. I'm going to just pick Top Station. Uh, I'm going to just pick Hip Hop and R&B. I have the volume on low so you won't hear it playing. But um, let me back out. So you have this uh, effect when you back all the way out. All right, let me stop it. In the sub menu, you have MP3 streams and Django. Here we have our add-ons. The sub menu, you have your video add-ons, music add-on, program add-on, picture add-on. Let's go into video add-ons. These are the add-ons that's in here. Let's start from the top. So it's 42 add-ons in here. Alright, let's go into your program add-on. There is um 
maintenance tool in here. I use Indigo. Let's go into maintenance tools. I usually leave the thumbnails um on there. I have it configured when you download it, I have it configured to where it would delete the packages and um yeah, it's your packages and you know crash logs and stuff like that. But the, and um when it populates the thumbnails, you know, and you keep it running like that, it doesn't pull from too many sources at one time, which will give your device lag. You'll get lag. So once the thumbnails is there, it's not gonna download the thumbnails again because they're already there. So if you delete the thumbnails, it's pulling from all those sources again from those add-ons for the thumbnails to generate, which will probably slow your device down. So, you know, once every three or four days or whatever, if you feel like, you know, you had, it's populating too much and stuff like that, you could always come in here and delete your thumbnails. All right. And um, here we have our weather. Let's go into our weather. If you want to configure this, you just press up. You go to add on settings. Go to location. You put in your location. After you put, put in your location, you go to OK and then click OK. It might need a restart of Cody or you could just go all the way up to power and then reload the skin. All right, here we have our settings. And also you have your favorites folder in here. It's not in there. And underneath settings, you'll find your file manager and your quit button. Now let's go back to add-ons. Let's go to program add-ons. Let's go to super favorites. Now, as I explained to you in, um, in the TV section, no, the channel section in the sub menu and if you don't want this um the channels in here you can always go in here and you know delete them by bringing up your context button you'll go to edit super favorites and remove favorite all right whatever channels you don't want in here Alright, so there you have it. Now I'm going to show you how to install this build. You will go into your file manager. You go to add source. You click on none. And you'll put in http colon dash forward slash forward slash um, Aries dash repo dot eu and you click on done you can name it whatever you want I'll name it Aries and then hit save I like to double check make sure I put the link in correctly so I'll scroll to whatever I named I named the Aries and I see item in there that means I put in um uh, the source correctly now I'll go to install from zip file so I'll go in there then I'll go to install from zip file and I'll scroll down to Aries because I named it Aries and then install it I already have the Aries wizard installed so I might as well say update it as you can see so just wait for it to install and then you'll go up one time and go to install from repository, scroll down to Aries project, go to program add-ons, and then install the Aries wizard. Alright, so once it's been installed, it'll be in your programs section of Kodi. And then you'll go into the Aries wizard. Give it a, a moment for it to come up. All 
all right so once it comes up you could go to browse builds and then you'll scroll down to the name Steven which is right here you'll click on that and it's right here the cinema build all right you could click on that if you've done a fresh start already you could just install it as you can see on the bottom right is 292 292 megabytes so I try to keep the cinema build light you also have a cinema X build in here which I'll be updating it has more add-on and it's 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 um, 388 megabytes and you also have an adult version all right so you go to the cinema build I'm gonna do a fresh start it says this will remove all add-ons ECT from Cody are you sure hit click yes hit proceed All right, Cody needs to be closed. I hit OK. Now, if it doesn't close for you, I suggest you unplug your device from um, from your power source, or you know, you go into your apps where your apps are located and foreclose it that way. All right, so I'm gonna go back into Cody. I'm gonna go to Add-ons, Program Add-ons, and then go to Aries. All right, and now I'm gonna go back into browse builds and then scroll down to the name Steven. All right, I'm gonna click on that and then I'm gonna go to the Krypton Cinema build. Let the art pop up so you can know that you're at the right place. All right, so I'm gonna click on that and then hit install. And then proceed. You could fast forward if you want to. I'm a um, like I said, uh, you know, I don't want to make this too long of a video, so uh, I'm gonna skip skip ahead to where it says extracting files all right so i'll be right back all right so we finished downloading and finished extracting the files now you get this dialog um, that popped up it says do you want to back up i click no click no again and then press ok all right i'm gonna go back into cody Now, with installing any build, make sure you give it some time to let it populate what it needs to do in the background. You know, let it do its thing, let it settle in. All right, so here you have it, it's the cinema build. And um, for those that don't know about Real the Bread, there's a lot of videos out there on um, in YouTube where you could, you know, if you want to get the, the account it'll show you how to do it and for this build if you want to set it up you'll just go into settings you go to system you go to add-ons and then slide over to the right you go to manage dependencies all right and then you'll scroll down which will be on the bottom URL resolver and then you go to configure and then scroll down one time to Universal Resolvers. And then scroll down till you see Real the Brid. Then you'll go to Authorize My Account. 
Now I'll go to that website that's right there on my phone. All right, and I'm gonna type in the um, the little code it gives me there. X D R G R. All right, you give it a second. As you can see on the bottom right, it says you are on Real the Brit Resolver authorized. And now you're good to go. And you could use, you know, the functionality it has on it. All right, thank you guys for watching. If you're new to my channel, hit that subscribe button, and I'll talk to you guys soon.